The California condor is a grand bird for a Grand Canyon. With a wingspan of over three meters, it is North America's largest flying land bird. The Grand Canyon has not always been as dry as it appears to us today. 50,000 years ago, it was actually quite lush and giant sloths roamed this area. One of the animals that was also found during that time was the condor. Fossil records have been found showing that the California condor lived in this area almost 50,000 years ago. However, we almost lost the condor for good. His visitation by humans to the Grand Canyon has reached over 4 million people each year. Visitation by California condors has dropped dramatically. In the 1980s, there was only 22 birds left. A decision was made, heartbreaking as it was, to remove the remaining condors from the wild and put them into a captive breeding program. Fortunately, the organizations involved were successful in breeding the condors in captivity, and since then, they have been able to build the population to a level where half of the population has been re-released into the wild. There's approximately 387 condors in the world and about 70 of those live in the Grand Canyon area. With some searching and a little luck, you can see the condors flying over the Grand Canyon, usually between the months of May and September. This bird doesn't appear at all disturbed by the raven who continues to harass them. This is condor number 87. He's a 14 year old male and he's paired with condor number 33. This year they produced a chick. Imagine he's sunning himself to warm up or to let his wings restore their shape. The air pressure from their nine and a half foot wingspan as they flap through the air is immense. So the next time you go to the Grand Canyon, look up and maybe you'll be rewarded with the sight of one of the world's rarest birds. <laughs>